Hello, my name is Mikel Ford. And I'm Amanda Perales. And we are part of Emoticon's Illuminati planning team. And we'd like to officially welcome you to the award ceremony for the Emoticon 2020 NYC Youth Digital Media and Technology Challenge. Woo! The five award categories are... Best Pitch. This award is given to the project that displays superior documentation, storytelling, and project demo. And the award for best pitch goes to... Sanit Safe. Sanit Safe is a device prototype by Daniel, a high school student from the Scholars Academy and Cooper Union STEM program. Congratulations, Daniel. I liked your project a lot because it used a lot of documentation that is used in real life engineering, such as the decision matrix and the flow charts, as well as uh, stating out a problem statement for which you're, you're planning to solve. I thought that it had a lot of ingenuity in terms of using today's technologies to solve a problem that we're facing uh, globally. The next award is the most entertaining award. This award is given to the project that engages users in playful ways. And the winner of the Most Entertaining Award goes to... Project Tomo, a social impact game by Brandon, Farden, and Jawad, high school students from the Games for Change program at Information Technology High School. Congratulations to the three of you. There is um, lots of great detail. I like the team collaboration, and each team member has a different role, so they can help each other. I was very impressed with uh, their project being visual compelling and not too complicate. I particularly love their character illustration and how they are visualized in unique game interface. Good job. The next award is Most Innovative. This award is given to the project that combines creativity, ingenuity, and forward-thinking design or production. And the Most Innovative Award goes to Venture Out, an assistive technology app design by Tim, Carlos, Fatimata, Sam, Maisha, Andy, Elio, Naraya, and Daniel, high school students from Mouse Design League. Congratulations to the team behind Venture Out uh, on winning the most innovative prize. We are so impressed by the way that you took the experiences of real people and designed a creative solution to meet their needs. The next award is for Point of View. The Point of View Award is given to the project that reframes issues, interactions, or experiences in a way that enlightens the audience. And the Point of View Award goes to Life Under COVID-19, an interactive documentary by Keila, Kaylee, Philip, Heather, Anthony, Dede, Alicia, Kaz, and Damani, all high school students from the Educational Video Center. Congratulations. Congratulations to Life Under COVID-19 for winning the Point of View Award. Your project is thought-provoking and starts a conversation about understanding inequity in education by looking at the past. And I loved how you plan to have a different experience for different audiences uh, who looked at, at your website. So congratulations. The last award is for most social impact. It is given to the project that makes meaningful change within a local or global community that it serves. The award for most social impact goes to Crisis in Venezuela, a choose your own adventure social impact game by middle school students from the Global Kids program at PS96. Congratulations. Congratulations to Crisis in Venezuela for the most social impact award um, at Emoticon 2020. We really love your project because it tells uh, a really important story today um, and it engaged people in a conversation to build empathy and community and help one another. So congratulations. The judges also selected these amazing honorable mention projects. DJ Alex Turntable from Dream Yard Design League, Save the Earth, Duck Tears, from JHS 189Q. Win the Power, from Halsey Middle School. Quarantines, from EVC. And Promoting STEAM through Equity, Opportunity, and Unity, by the Full Metal Beavers' first robotics team. 
Thank you to the over 87 student groups who submitted projects to our 12th annual Emoticon, our biggest Emoticon ever. This was our first year trying a virtual project fair, and quite honestly, we did not know what was going to happen. But over 300 middle and high school students participated, even though we're all stuck at home. Every project you shared shows how innovative, creative, and radical New York City teens are. Thank you again, and we'll see you, hopefully in person, in 2021. Thank you so much. Woo! Woo! Like, like basically one take you guys. <laughs>